Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. I am sitting in my garage, but I'm about to head off to do some decor shopping. Um, I, You guys voted for this video over on my Instagram. You guys wanted to see a summer haul, some summer finds. So that is what I'm doing for you guys. Yesterday I did get my wisdom teeth pulled all four of them so my cheeks are a little bit puffy I may be talking a little bit weird but I'm just super excited I'm feeling okay though and I'm super excited to make this video for you guys so let's get shopping first guys I decided to make my way over to the Dollar Tree just to see I haven't been here in a few months and I wanted to check out what new items they had out for this summer months um, they had these t-shirts which were great quality these were children's size I know they have adult sizes as well and I don't think you can beat that price for just a dollar bubbles 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 galore they had so many different bubble things and for each one being a dollar I thought that was a great price price these little bubble trays they're kind of the ones that are no spill I thought that was a great little price for just a dollar and then I love these bubble frisbees but oh my gosh I can see my kids like hitting themselves in the head with those with um flying bubbles I thought this little girl's nail polish was really cute and it's water-based and scented so it doesn't have that stinky gross smell that normal nail polish it polishes do um they had so many graduation items this frame is only a dollar and i bought one the day before because my son is graduating this year um for 29.99 at michael's but that frame almost looks identical for it and i could have saved um 28 um i really like these napkins i had bought some the day before so i didn't need to grab those but if you guys have a graduate for 2021 dollar tree is your place to go to when i taught every year i hosted graduation for my class and i always got our stuff from dollar tree a lot of things i could reuse as long as it didn't have the year on it and they held up well so now i'm going to make my way to the back of the store and i you guys know i love these bins for organizing and i love that for summer they added pops of color i am a white and gray kind of girl but if you like to add a little color in your life Dollar Tree is your place and then USA Americana Memorial Day 4th of July they had a ton of decor for that as well these planes I bought from Michaels last year it wind up not making it but I think to pay a dollar for them instead of the five bucks or whatever I paid at Michaels they're great entertainment for your littles but look at all of this USA stuff so stinking cute I had to leave it at the store because I need to go through my stuff just to see what I have before I purchase anything else. I'm trying to be really intentional about the items that I am bringing in my home. As I am recording this, we have just done a major declutter. The kids did of their room. Me and my husband did of our room. So I'm just trying to be super intentional about the items that we're bringing in our home. But look at these little wings. So stinking cute for a little girl. Um, for the 4th of July um, and then I loved all their signs and all their fun stuff so if you are in the market I would also like to know down in the comments below do you guys decorate for Memorial Day do you decorate for the 4th I did a poll over on my Instagram I will have that link down below but it was about 50 50 of people that decorated for Memorial Day and 4th of July and people that didn't I will be making a few videos on the topic I will be doing my backyard um, my port patio area and my front yard that area so stay tuned for those that will be coming up very soon for the 4th of July on my channel. I simply love Americana decor. Um, now I made my way over to all of the pool and beach type toys. I always buy those um, balls each year. They're not the best, best quality, but they'll last you about a season. And for a dollar, who can beat that price? And then I loved all of these water toys. I can't wait for us to go swim in the pool and then just have fun doing all those fun summer activities. So Dollar Tree was kind of a bust. So let's head on over to Hobby Lobby. And for Hobby Lobby, I wanted to show you guys 
first, all of the 4th of July stuff. They probably have the cutest 4th of July stuff that is out. Actually, I'll take it back. I need to go to Kirkland's first to make a sound decision. But I think they have cuter stuff than, at, than what's at Target. And the prices, you just can't beat. So really cute wooden signs. A lot of this stuff I've had from previous years and it just holds up so good and I just love it. But so much 4th of July stuff. Like I said, I need to inventory what I have and none of this stuff was on sale yet. So at Hobby Lobby, wait till next week and a lot of these items will be on sale. So I just had to hold my horses and take a little inventory in my head of everything they had. I really came to Hobby Lobby because so many people have been posting about this 75% off sale, so I had to go to my local Hobby Lobby and take a look for myself. And there were some good items, not as many as some people had at their stores, but I did find some cute stuff. Look at the prices of these signs. Like, you're never gonna, f these signs are normally like $29, $49, somewhere around there, and they were all under 15 even the really, really big ones. So such cute signs. If you are looking for that big special piece above a bed, above a sofa, these chalkboard looking type signs are always popular. And I thought this one was really cute. I just couldn't pinpoint a space where it will go in my home, but such cute items. And I loved these prints. I kept going back and forth about debating about putting them above my bed, but you, I will show you later what I chose and said, but these are gorgeous and beautiful. And then so many different prints and items. And like I said, all of these signs and all of these pieces were under $15. And then this little tray, if you like the black and white theme in your home, this is so great. Hobby Lobby has really stepped up the, their game. I love this clock, but it's not quite my style. But if you have those pops of gold in your house and enamel, go run a Hobby Lobby and grab this clock. It's so stinking cute. But I, I wanted to say they really have upped their game. They used to just be farmhouse decor, which you guys know I love, but I feel like I'm more like farmhouse. I like a little bit of boho. I don't even really know my style. It's more eclectic, but Hobby Lobby has gotten a lot of different types of items and they are more eclectic, I will say. So whatever your decor style is, Hobby Lobby has something for you. And then these lockers, I was going back and forth about, I may go back and pick them up, but I thought they would be really cute in my son's room just to organize books or whatever. He doesn't have like little kid books, but just to organize things on his wall. But such cute items and the prices are so great. Guys, go that my Hobby Lobby had two aisles of clearance items, which were 75% off, but they were also in the different aisles. So I had to literally go down almost every aisle and every aisle had different clearance items there. I don't know if they, they were in the process of moving everything to a certain section, but I had to go down different aisles and you guys will see that to find different clearance items. But I didn't mind. I was by myself this day and I just had a fun time shopping. And you can see I'm going back to these prints because they are so beautiful and under $7. The spring shop at this time, so 4th of July stuff was not on sale, but the spring shop, shop section was also on sale for 50% off. So I took a look there too, and I got a few items for that. I will haul everything at the end, but let's relax, turn on a little bit of music, and let's check out Hobby Lobby together. Child, I know you're hurt and you can't let go. It's not your fault, and you don't deserve all the bad in the hurt. Ooh, I know you tried so hard. I know you've done your part 
It's not fair You did your time How much longer will you suffer in this life? But don't give up Just hold on tight It'll be alright All your life you've tried To be a good man inside Did everything that you thought you should Didn't seem to do you any good Ooh, I know you've tried so hard It's not fair You did your time How much longer will you suffer in this life? But don't give up Just hold on tight It'll be alright of haul everything that I picked up. I did show you a little bit at the Dollar Tree. I didn't get much there. Um, only thing I did is get the little toilet bowl <laughs> cleaners that we needed, the little brushes. But besides that, I didn't get much there. Hobby Lobby was having, like I said before, their 75% off sale. It was, there were two rows and then it was kind of scattered throughout the store. So I picked up this little um, cookbook or holder, and then it has this on the back. It was only $4.99, and I just love the, dis the distressed wood and then the white. I think it looks super cozy and worn in, and I love it. And then for $4.99, how can you beat that price? And then I also picked up these candlestick holders and I am in love with them. Um, they were only $3.99 a piece. So I have this shape in size and then two of this shape in size. So I don't really know how I'm gonna style them. I can style them with candles or without or lay them out as a set of three with the shorter one in the middle but I'm super excited and they're heavy, they're metal, but they are so cute. They're kind, they're iron colored, but they're like brown and kind of weathered. I just love them. And these were originally $15 a piece, which I would not pay for that, but $3.99, I'll do that. And then the cookbook holder was originally $20, like, that's kind of ridiculous, but I love it and it'll be fit perfectly with like my summer decor. For summer this year, I'm gonna do kind of neutral, which I think I did last year as well. So I'm gonna bring out a lot of my neutral decor. I would will add in pops of yellow here and there. I think it just brightens and freshens up a space, but for the most part, it'll be pretty neutral. And then this is not, but I grabbed um, this for Brooklyn's room. You guys know it is unicorn theme. I will link that video down below, but it was only $4.99 and it's originally $17.99. So I thought that was a great deal. 
I feel like I am talking so weird, but bear with me guys. Just got my wisdom teeth pulled out yesterday. And then um, I picked up these two prints. They were, they were listed as, they're originally 50 bucks and I got them for $12.49 a piece. So this one, I think I'm gonna put this over my bed. I kind of want to change it out over there I, in my master bedroom. So I got this one and they kind of have like shiplap in the back. And I thought the florals were perfect for these summer months. And then this one. So there we go. And I love them. Two different flowers. Just so cute. And they're alike, but they are different as well. And I think they'll complement each other good above my bed and just add like a nice, soft touch. And then that was it for clearance item. The clearance items. They had a ton of stuff, but these were the items that I felt like I couldn't leave without. And then in the spring. Um, shop area they had 50% off all of their spring items and I picked up this new rug for our kitchen and I think it will be perfect for spring and summer I just love the blues the lighter blue the white I think it'll be just fresh and I'm so ex I can't wait to use it so I picked up that that was priced at $15.99 but I got it for half off and then I picked up this teapot from um, Dolly Parton. She does have a line at Hobby Lobby. And I'll show you. I took it out of the box and everything. But I love it. It's like speckled. This was listed also for $30, but I got it for $15. So it's speckled. It's that pretty color that I like. And I'm going to sit this on my stovetop. Um, and I think it'll grow great. You guys know how much I love this color and then it'll go so good with the rug, just adding those little pops of blue and that kind of seafoam green, green. But that is it guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope you like shopping with me.